wanted to today. Today is Wednesday. This is a show week, and I wanted to tell you guys that Gabby has a channel. Gabby does have a channel. Uh, Gabby has a video up on her channel. Uh, she's preparing for show week, and it is a special kind of horse show. We're going to something totally different, totally new. If you want to see what it is, keep watching, because I'm sure I'm going to share that. Or go and watch her new video about her show series. Her channel is I'm Always Gabby. Always Gabby? What is your channel? I don't know. <laughs> She hasn't posted on it in so long, we forget what it's called. I'm, no, always Gabby. I'm sure it's always Gabby. But anyways, uh, we're getting ready. I'm Dad editing. Dad thought of the name. Yeah, Dad thought of the name. In fact, I think if Gabby's gonna keep her channel, she's due for an upgrade. She's due for like something new, something more her age and her, like I think she should put her own spin on her own channel. I'm waiting for what that to happen. Yeah, we don't even know what Sophie's channel is called life. we may sophie's life gabby got it sophie's life because yeah. the intro was funny <laughs> well yeah like their channels were made when they were really young so they're they're ready for an upgrade but anyway i'm editing videos this morning and then we're headed out to do a bunch of stuff but i want to show you guys a miracle that happened in the day by day and, family um, a lot of people would never thought this was going to happen a lot of people but it did and some, we're going to prove it to you i also want to show you the house i made in all the right let's place. show them okay so this is the inside of it sylvie made this house on so roblox that's, that's front door and you walk in and on either side there is these little things, hold on. All right. And you can look at the window, it's on both sides. Is that the bathroom? No, oh. it's a little hangout area. Okay, well we don't have time. This is the bathroom. And then over here. I need to add like a kitchen and stuff. Yeah, and windows maybe, because it's kind of dark. And there's this room, I need to delete that, but I don't Okay, want all right, my battery's dying. My house is better. My all right, so let's move on to horse stuff, horse related stuff. Some of you guys are concerned, have been concerned about Sophie's boots because she has never taken the opportunity to wear them in and zip them up all the way and break them in. And she's had them for quite a long time. And today is the day, today is the day that Sophie is, is working on getting her boots broken in enough so that she can wear them and nobody will be upset by her. Does it bother you when you ride? Your horse with your boots not done up all the way. Yeah, it's not a big thing for Sophie. Do you know that some people say that it affects how you move your leg and how you move your leg is how you ride your horse and that it can affect training and riding? It's not something that's like a big deal to her. Do I ride with my boots done up all the way? Absolutely. Does Gabby? Absolutely. It's not a big deal for Sophie. And that's just who she is and that's okay. But she's, one for one time you get it. <laughs> she's like, I'm never zipping them up all the way again. <laughs> it's torture is torture anyway there you go you had there you have it sophie finally did up her boots and it's gonna be okay now you guys it's all gonna be okay and i found a bunch of pictures of finn in my room so i hung them up sophie it made this little montage Don't touch this it little ball. what's this it called one's kind of hidden yeah this little thing of finny i saw a video of him today on my computer it just popped up there and he was it was one of our last things with him and I had like footage that I didn't even share and it just made me feel Molly! Oh, Molly! What are you trying to say? Mm -hmm. Goodbye Finn! <laughs> anyway, just so you guys know, we still love him. We're getting ready to go to the barn for lessons and it's supposed to be a rainy night. It's supposed to rain tonight. I'm thinking maybe we should put horses on grass for their nighttime grass now. Anyway, but we are taking all of our stuff to the barn. So we're taking some of our stuff today and then we're taking some more stuff on Friday during the day. So I washed Gabby's other saddle pad that she uses for shows. This is not it. This is just like an extra one that we're going to bring. But uh, a couple of people are disappointed in her choice of saddle pad, her show pad. It's just like literally this much too small for her saddle. And I've shared with you guys in the past, like... We have such a massively made different saddle. Like Gabby's saddle, it was like a new model the year that we bought it. They were trying something new. We like it, our horses like it, but they don't make saddle pads to fit underneath it. It's got like a really thick base. I'll try and show you guys when we get to the barn, but because it's got this really thick base, no matter like what you do, it's difficult to find saddle pads that, that, that fit it. Yeah, we're trying to get ready. <laughs> Right now to go, we're a bit early, but it's gonna rain. What about dinner? Yeah, I'm gonna go make dinner too. I can't remember if I told you guys, but 
Do you remember the show series, the Gabby shows, the Trillium show series, the one that we go to uh, canceled for the rest of the season. So we had to choose another show series. We decided, our barns decided on another one that is literally a three day show series. So every show she goes to will be for a full weekend. So we're having to like pack so differently. It's gonna be such a different experience. The only time we've ever slept away at a horse show has been when we went to Champs. And this will be like that, but a little bit different. And I'll explain what we're gonna do that's making it a little bit different. Uh, so we're gonna need a hay bag. What do you guys think of Sophie's boots now that they're all done up? And I think, um, and I think I just heard Penny push something. Did you? I heard Penny push something too. Should we go check? Yeah, we should go check. Hi. Penny, what'd you push? Penny, what'd you push? Penny's in heat, so I don't know what she's pushing, but she's... Well, there's a bunch of poles moved around. And there's a lot of pee. She's like, bring me treats! This is how she tells us. Hello. Hello. You look like you have devil ears. Willow and Penny are extra special friends right now while Penny's in heat. It's supposed to be severe thunderstorms. Severe. Like we haven't had enough. <laughs> at least it's not a tornado. That's so pretty. Look. Yeah, look at this. So pretty. It does not look anywhere near as pretty in the camera, but it's so pretty. It's so light. Last night we went to Costco and we bought a bunch of things. I'm going to show you a couple of things. But we got these gardening gloves and I'm obsessed with them. It was 10 pairs for $10. I actually like to show you guys things that I love. But anyway, they're super grippy and they're so comfortable and anybody can wear them. They fit everyone. They even fit Sam. And they're so good for pulling weeds. And in each package you get purple, green, and blue. So the other thing that we got is this and I'm really excited about it because my grandkids are going to be coming soon. And Gabby put it together for us last night. Wow, looks like some kind of animal walked on it. But it is a... Uh, huge swing that you attach to trees so i either want to put it in this tree right here so i can we can swing in it sit in it and watch the horses or i want to put it in this tree i just don't see how easy it's going to be because this tree is so high so again we can sit out here and watch the horses in the shade i'm excited about that i'm excited to share it with the grandkids we're not going to say anything you can't this going to be a sneak attack a sneak attack you guys we're gonna sneak up and chance. Whoops. We're gonna sneak up and chance. We're not gonna call his name. So I, we... I saw him. I literally stopped for two seconds to look at the chickens because I love chickens. And Sophie's gone. Like she just flew by me. So today is our saddle fit video. I don't think that we're gonna be making a video. We'll we'll try and take you guys along through the whole saddle fit thing. So you guys know in the past we bought custom saddles, and the reason that we bought custom saddles is because we found it really difficult to find saddle fitters in our area and custom saddles are just so much easier you call the rep they come they measure the, your horse Poof. three months later you have a saddle Why? you peed yeah you peed that's not much oh yeah that's a lot of pee whoa i can't even see it but in the camera i can see it why did you have to pee why that? did you have to pee see you got even better Drawing getting fatter. He could get fatter faster. What? Um, Chan comes to me in the field. And yeah. then he realizes that I'm coming to catch him, to ride him. Yeah. And he's like, no, I'm running away now. Yeah. After I like, have a hole through almost gone. So we have two things planned for today. We're doing a saddle fit, and then she's going to ride in oh, another saddle. Wow. In the last... He's rolling. <laughs> in the last... See, as soon as I put him in here, he has a droopy lip. In the last four rides, she's ridden in four different saddles, I think. Something like that. Three rides. Yeah. One, two, three. Three different, three different saddles. Also, the saddle fitter called and said, like, there's supposed to be a massive storm today. I know he's young. I don't know how you feel about trying to sit, fit him for a saddle in a really bad storm with so much noise. And I was like, you know, I was here when there was a tornado, an actual tornado, and we were in the barn. It sounded like the barn was going to rip him in half. And he just stood there. He perked his head forward. He, he perked his ears forward once. He wasn't the least bit nervous, so I think he'll be okay.
You want to teach him stay? Yeah, stay. My horse Yeah, Gabby, your horses no stay. stay because they don't have any desire to walk. Stay. Yeah, I think... <laughs> yeah, can I stay with you? Wait, Gabby, you got treats? Let me have it. Oh, look at him. He's licking his lips. Um, so, we have like a non-slip one that's not a riser and we put it on his skin and he sweats so bad so we changed it. But this is so breathable. And this helps with slipping, and not just to the side, but back and forth. Yeah. So if you have a shark fin for a weather, you're going to find a shark fin. fin. Should call him shark. Mm. Yeah, we're looking at breaking here, but that's just because he has to No, yeah. Yeah, we're never going to fix that until he builds muscle. Mm. So this is a good option. If we can find a gullet that's... The goal is so wide if you would come Right, so we did the saddle fit. I didn't video it. I think I videoed like a couple of seconds just so that I could remember what she was saying. But it was really interesting. I loved the girl so much. She's like so well spoken and that is what I need to understand stuff. I understood everything that she said. He basically has a shark fin, you guys know, because he's so under muscled. And as he develops and changes, that will change a little bit. But, um, so he needs very specific on his saddle. And what was really lucky is that we had like our saddle, Gabby's saddle, Sophie's saddle. She had two saddles. She had three saddles to try. Then we have like a stall full of saddles for sale. And we got to try those ones. There was one, we've actually ridden them in a lot of those. We, we tried so many saddles. And then we even moved to like the the barn saddles that they use for the for the lesson ponies and so we were able to try those and the one that fits Denver and fits Sophie kind of really worked for him so we need to make a few changes with it but is the only one out of all those saddles that kind of worked for him ideally we're looking for a saddle that will fit him and Sophie as much as possible until he builds up a top line because you have to take the horses you have to fit the horse before you can fit the before. the horse's fit is more important and both of the fits are important obviously because if you're not fitting properly in a saddle then you're not going to ride properly and it can cause a lot of problems for the horse yes we get that but right now we're just in the in the figuring it all out stages and so I'm trusting her I love her she's amazing and we're gonna let her do her thing and then she's gonna get us into a saddle for chance a temporary saddle a saddle that will buy that will likely be temporary until he builds a top line or even the one that he rode the one that he likes is actually adjustable so if we get a saddle like that then it might be the saddle that she ends up with so that's it that is the whole saddle fit drama here we got here so early because we had to wait for the we had to do the saddle fitter thing so we're just waiting for our turn to get tacked up and Sophie just showed Elizabeth Chance's new shoes. What do you think of his new shoes? Aren't they beautiful? Like so exciting, like the most exciting thing. <laughs> yeah, Julie and Kate are coming. Everybody's Normally coming. Normally you're last one outside. I'm gonna die. I know. How was Gabby in a sweater? How was Gabby in three shirts? Three shirts. Two, yeah. Two shirts. One shirt, one sweater, and a bag. She has no internal thermostat. She's always cold. I wish I had me. I'm, I'm, I'm already I wish I had me. I know. My hair is sweating, making me sweat. Yeah, we had to bring Chance in here because he was sweating in the stall. It's, there's actually a really nice breeze outside. Like, if you... Okay. So, like, it's nice and breezy in here, and it's breezy in the barn. It's just, like, when you're in the stall that it's hot. He said don't rip the fluffy thing you put on the top of the camera so that the wind doesn't affect it, and it's gone. Where'd it go? I don't know. So anyways, who's everybody riding? You're riding Chance. Lily. You're riding Lily. Hey, Liz. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say who I'm oh, riding. Oh, sorry. Who are you riding? Chance. Who are you riding? Female. Who are you riding? I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> I love how excited you sound. I can't let that Who's Katie, Kate riding? Oh, watch. Her. Oh, she shed a layer. Look at her go. You had a long pleat shirt under that? Did you know that? Has mesh. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but you still match. Oh, I love you. You guys still match. All right, now we're late. I don't know what we were doing, but anyways, so we got Chino in here. I'd recognize that boy anywhere. Wait, are you Chino? Yeah, you're Chino. I can tell by those brown eyes. And we have Chance here, and he's gonna ride in a different saddle today. And I think I'm excited to see him ride in a new saddle. But you guys, you know how you say, like, once he's fit, he's going to be changing. And so once we got the shoes on, I noticed a huge change in speed 
and everything. So once he gets like a good saddle, that could be like a huge change in him. So we'll see. That moment when you realize you're out of water. Just trying to be the first one, Gino. <laughs> Go. Go behind him. <laughs> it's like, nope, not today. Whenever you walk behind this boy, he always goes. It's a race. It's a race to the mounting block. I shouldn't be. Oh, you're a jockey. All right, number two. Gabby, you're number two. Look at where my knees are. All right, who's number three? Chance is still getting saddled. His girth tightened. We got Elizabeth. How the heck did that happen? Is that what you meant? Kids are getting too old. Wow, there's a lot of drama. A lot of drama. Ron, you're number three. <laughs> when you're so little and all they have to do is put their head down and you're gone. Here, give me your head. Get up here. Stop. Oh, wow. Jeez, Louise, you were on before I even got his head up. All right, number three. No, when I... Number four. <laughs> Don't you know that?